Yo, 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 what's going on, everyone? What's going on, Gazaga fan? Angel Galvez, what's going on, bro? Man, we are back. We are back. Luke Blocks, what's going on? We are back, man. Mr. Top 5, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Week 7. Our Utah State Aggies are ranked number 7, man. Touchdown to home runs. What's up? All right, guys. I um, apologize for the impromptu stream, man. I was trying to get a video done, like the Delaware video. I was literally trying to get that done, and it kept crashing every time I tried to, like, render the video. So I'm going to try to work on that after the stream and hopefully get that video out tomorrow, man. But we're here. We are here, man. Utah State. Give a few more uh, moments for people to get in here, man. Who you got in the Super Bowl? I'm still going to roll with the Chiefs, even though uh, Mahomes... You know, Mahomes is a little <laughs> a little banged up at the moment. We'll see what happens, man. Bingo stock. BNGO stock, man. Let's go Fresno State. I think they won their last game, at least in here, man. So we are 6-0. We are 6-0, man. And I was looking at the Heisman list. Now, I don't think this is going to hold up. But look at the Heisman list, man. We have Gerald Bright on the list i don't know why he only had four carries for 27 yards last game he did get injured he should hopefully be back but he's on the list man um 77 attempts this season 456 yards just under six yards of carry um six rushing touchdowns man so he's been the guy he's been the guy for us so um i don't know how he's on the heisman list but things are going to change man because um middle tennessee state i don't know what they are doing currently but take a look at this man Take a look at what Middle Tennessee State is doing. So we'll go to last week first, right? Uh, let's see. So they won 85 to 40. Clearly no defense played in that game for whatever reason, man. But take a look at the wide receiver. Uh, wide receiver Pierce, 15 catches for 731 yards and seven touchdowns. Uh, can you play me in NCAA for PS3? I do not have it on PS3, bro. Um, fi anyway, 15 carries for 731 yards and seven touchdowns. That was last week, and he follows that performance up. Um, let's see, follow that performance up. Why is it not? I don't know why it's not showing me the info, but he followed that performance up by going crazy again this week. So, um, I, I don't know who's going to win the Heisman other than him, man, but it's definitely going to be him. Big fan, bro. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate you for also coming through to the stream, man. So um, that's what's going on. So we do have technically a Heisman watch candidate. I don't think he's going to win it, man. We are taking on Boise State. They are three and two. We are six and zero. Oh. Uh, we we are better than them overall rating, but we seen last game NCAA is trying to get us in one of these trap games. They are desperately trying to get us to lose one of these games, man. And it, it may happen. Who knows, man? Boise State is better. Um, on paper than BYU is. And BYU took us a double overtime, man. Um, let's go through first things first. Take a look at recruiting. You see 3,700 points. Significantly less po or more points than before. And you will see why, man. We finally got our first commitments of the year, man. I believe it was two. I think we got two. We brought in pretty much every single recruit that we could bring in last game. So um, Antoine Price... A Juco running back, we were able to get him to sign on the dotted line, man. Only 80 speed, so not that fast. Has 88 acceleration. I like the 84 break tackle. Elusiveness, 87. Juke move, 93. Even a spin move at a 91. Could definitely work on his trucking at being at 50, especially being that slow. Carrying isn't that good either, man. So hopefully, um, hopefully, you know. He could be decent for us. Now, Kyle Robertson is the guy that we signed. Hopefully, we don't lose Jordan Love this offseason, and he could come back. Luke, what's going on, bro? Welcome to the stream, man. Hopefully, he could come back, but Kyle Robertson is a guy that we signed. I don't want to play him as a true freshman. If we have to, then we have to. But 85 throw power, 76 throw accuracy. Hopefully, that is good enough um, 
you know, to, to be a guy that could potentially be the quarterback of the future, man. But those are the two guys that we did sign. As for the rest of the recruiting this week, we haven't done it yet. So let's take a look at Reggie Johnson. 310 points. We are in the lead form. Um, a significant lead. So he had a good visit. He had a good visit. 850 points. I'm not going to complain with that. We met all three goals. We beat our rival. Gave us 200 points. So I'm cool with that, man. We need him to sign before week 10. It's currently week 7. We need him to sign before week 10. Week 10, he's going to go to Iowa, and anything can happen once these guys start going on their visits, man. Um, he's 99% locked, so hopefully next week he locks out Indiana. He locks out Arizona State, and it'll be down between us, Iowa, and Vandy. But I think we need to sign him before week 10. Uh, Marlon Frederick, we are still the guy, clearly. Um... I don't think he's ready for Oh, he is ready for a visit. So we're going to bring him down this week against Boise State. Why not? Um, we're all by ourselves in this race, man. 74 overall cornerback. We definitely want to bring him in. Um, Corey Olsen, he had a solid visit, man. We are now on top, on top of Arizona State. We need him to sign before week 14. So we have a little bit more time to kind of work with. But we should, you know, constantly every week get more and more points because the bonus is so high. Um, he had... Uh, 450 point visit i'm cool with that one right there man uh lance martin i see fresno state trying to get in the game but we had the bonus on him so we should be able to bring him in even though we're only giving him 100 points we'll see if fresno ups that um our kicker uh i don't know if smu needs a kicker so oh uh, well they might because they have him scheduled for a visit week 12 so maybe they do bring him in uh we have him for a visit also i guess we'll bring him in this week why not we need some guys, man. Uh, I miss playing NCAA play since the 96 Sega days. Bro, I took I gave NCAA a long break and like just got back into it and been having so much fun playing NCAA, man. Um, Charmander head, if I'm saying that right. Welcome to the stream, bro. Alright, so um, what do we need for him? Kick a 40 plus yard field goal, be the conference team. I think we could do hopefully both of those. Our punter. Uh, Joe Graves, we're still on top. We're only giving him 300, so we're not going to bump that up. These backup quarterbacks, I really don't need them now because I did sign a quarterback, but it doesn't hurt to just give them 100 points apiece. Um, I think we're going to be able to bring both of these guys in. Not too worried there. The guard, I think we'll be able to bring him in. Defensive end, a great visit. I think we'll be able to bring him in. We have a huge bonus advantage over Colorado State. Um, for Steven Jones, a wide receiver, we should be able to bring him in. Defensive end. And we're on top, so let's go ahead and offer him a scholarship. I don't know why we haven't done that yet. Offer him a scholarship, man. Um, and hopefully he go ahead and he'll commit soon. Same with Graham Johnson. We're on top. Only giving him 25 points. I don't think we need to go any higher than that. Brandon Patterson. Maybe we put some more points on him because it looks like... Uh, it looks like Michigan is definitely trying to go grab him. We have a bunch of points, man. I'm over here being cheap. Let's just give him the full 500. Why not? Uh, wide receivers. Uh, Courtney Palmer, man. Uh, 200 points. We have, what, 130-point bonus advantage over BYU. Let's see what he is, man. I really don't remember him. Only 82 speed. Set, acceleration only 78, so that's terrible. Catching 74, route running is solid at a 77. He's 6'4. Uh maybe we'll bump him up to 300 points. I think we'll it's just a matter of time before we catch BYU though. He has a while before he's locked in, man. Um William King, another guy I think we'll might be able to grab, shockingly. Let's take him up maybe to 100 and offer him a scholarship. Give him the scholarly, man. He might be able to, <laughs> to commit after that. That's the goal, man. Um, let's see. Vince Talley, guard. Once again, I think we'll be able to pull him in, man. Only 64 overall, but this is just a, a depth piece. Add some depth to our lineup. Uh, JD Goat, it's a D Lo, you're my favorite YouTuber. I appreciate that, man. Try to make these things as entertaining as I can, man, for people who really like this type of stuff. Um, Darren Hunter, 62 overall outside linebacker. We are on top. Only giving him 25 points. We may not need to change that. We'll offer him a scholarly though, man. All right, here we go. Here's the running back situation. So did I end up scouting every single running back? 
we did all right so we did scout every single one so let's see how everything ended up with all five of these guys man we just need one we just need one to come um it looks like umass is definitely in the lead here we can come back though if i want to be petty we could give him 500 and try to pull something off there uh matt perry is a guy that i think we'll be able to get um uh, antoine hayes 1500 points back ah i mean it's the same thing man um but terry arnold is the guy i think that we'll be able to bring in so out of these guys really the 89 speed 88 acceleration only 51 trucking 65 brake tackle the elusiveness is pretty solid carrying is bad carrying is really bad so i'm guessing when we go out of these guys who would i prefer 58 carrying i do not like that at all I'm not a fan of that um nobody has standout ability maybe besides anthony tolbert but he's the guy that's going to be the hardest to actually be able to bring in so let's max him out this is what we're going to do that one guy we gave 500 points we're going to we're going to retract that a bit man we're going to track that to 250 we're going to 250 Um, does Tolbert have the scholarship? He does not, but we may not need to offer it to him yet. Um, let's go with Terry Arnold. I think it's only make sure. Yeah, the 89 speed guy. Let's go with him, man. Um, nah, let's go with him, man. None of these guys are, are the greatest guys in the world to me, but hey, we, we need more running backs on this team. All right, so then we're going to give him 250, man. So that's where we're at right there when it comes to our recruiting board. Let's make sure before we get out of here, everybody who is ready for a visit is scheduled. Yep, everybody who's ready for a visit is scheduled. So we're not missing out on anything this week. We have, I believe, two guys coming in this week, man. You see the recruiting classes so far. Uh, we are 52. We got two three stars. That's all we got so far, man. Um, but not bad. For um, year one of Utah State. I'll take it for sure. All right. I just wanted to see quickly who Kirk Curve Street picked to win. He picked us, man. Yeah, we got the two visits coming. All right. So... Let's see what we have to do, and then we can hop into the game. I don't know if on the loading screen it tells us what we need in terms of like the um, the visits. So Marlon Frederick, the guy we really want, man, have four swatted passes. That's a lot. Two interceptions. Hopefully we can pull that off, man. But we haven't been turning, uh, creating a lot of turnovers on defense. Be the conference team plus 100. I think we could definitely do that one. Um, then the kicker coming in, kick a 40 yarder, be the conference team. All right, man. So nothing crazy, no crazy lofty goals for us this week. Um, just hope our defense can step up. So we're at home again. Last time, I think we wore these. So let's. Uh. Let's go with let's go with the all navy for um Boise, man. Go with all navy for Boise State. See what happens. All right, so we're 16th in total defense, 14th in um, yards allowed, 4th in rushing defense. Our rushing defense is on point for sure. Um, our rushing offense isn't that high. Passing offense is solid at 38, though. Okay, so they are showing what we need. So at least future references we know right there, man. Um, you see our top guys. Woodward is on a high streak, 27 tackles this season, 4 TFLs, 1 sack. Jordan Love had a terrible game last week, but hopefully he could bounce back. I wouldn't say terrible because he, he played well. He just turned the ball over a lot. 
Are you able to do this on the new NCAA 14? Do you mean the revamped? If you're talking about revamped mod, you can't go online with it. At least on the 360 and the PC. Um, I'm not sure about PS3. So we, we actually are very close when it comes to yardage. We outgain them in passing. They outgain us by a lot in rushing yards. We both turn the ball over once per game. Um, 34 points for us, 30 points for them, man. So this one's going to be this one's gonna be tough. This one's going to be tough, man. But we're trying to stay ranked. We're trying to stay in the, in the top 10. A loss here to Boise is definitely taking us, taking us out of the top 10. So we don't want that. All right, so they win the toss. Uh, they're going to kick it. All right, man. So we're getting the ball first. Let's go make a statement. We'll see how this game plays out as they get so all we can do is go make a statement, man. And he got all, of this one. Great kick. all right, so Bright, the Heisman candidate. The oh, what a move. Oh, man, if he could have held that block. Who was that, 88? If he could have held that block. So I think we could have um, potentially returned that. What makes it so tough for this defense is you're not focusing in on just one guy. All right, man. Uh, an entire scheme, and okay. because of that diversity, I think it makes it more of a challenge. And you got to be better tacklers in the open field. And, Let's and go with the nice and easy run inside zone. Tackling and gang tackling and getting to the football. Hard to get to guys and make tackles. safeties are up, but we're still going to run this first play. See if we can get something. Oh, what a block shed! I thought we were going to be able to get through that gap. All right, so we have the power called. They have a safety down. Um, it's audible out of that. Ah, man. I didn't see that corner run up like that. But fortunately for us, man, it's third and one. So we're right there. Let's bring the two tight ends out. Bring the two tight ends out. Let's go with the sweep for now. We need to audible it. We'll audible out of it. I like this, though. Cut it up. There it is, man. Gerald Bright moving the chains. It's a good start. Audible to run again. There it is. Good block. Take seven yards, man. So no safety. So the blitz is coming from somewhere. Dump it down. Check downs, man, but it's working right now, so. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Under pressure. I miss why. I probably should have threw it away. I had like two chances to get it to him, man. I feel like I hesitated both times. Um, are you going to get the revamped? I have it, man. If you see a couple videos on my channel, uh, specifically last week and the week before that, man, um, I do have a college football revamp. But it's an online dynasty with me and my friends, man, on 360. So for these streams, they're going to just be the regular vanilla um, NCAA. Mm, third and one, man. But if you're talking about just videos with the revamped, I have some videos um, that's going to come out this week on the channel. And this play is number eight on the drive. All right, third and one. 
Ah, uh, did we throw? Oh, I thought we was about to throw a pick. I thought he undercut that. So we good, man. Let's see if we get a deep out route or this uh scene. There it is. Stay in bounds. Let's go. Great throw. Great catch. I was about to come down, but I seen that corner come down right there. So he ended up throwing on the deep out route, but it worked. Our right guard's tired, but it's all good, man. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 13. The quarterback in the gun. Empty backfield. Five wide receivers in the formation. There we go. Get in there. Touchdown, baby. Untouched. Gerald Bright, 13 yards. That's a great drive, man. We took a lot of time off the clock over half the quarter. Get into the end zone, man. Almost a perfect drive. 10 plays, 65 yards, 322. I'm cool with that. All right, man. Let's see if our defense can step up. Our defense stepped up when we needed to last game against BYU, man. But obviously, we gave up 40-something points. So, we don't want to do that again here today. All right, man. So here we go. First play. Hand it off. Great blocking, man. Ooh. Good tackle from behind. That could easily have been 20 plus yards. Another run. Yo, they oh yo, he just ran us over, man, and he is gone. So our number four rush defense in the country is not looking like that here. Alright, we got ourselves a game, fellas. Look at that, man. Bow. <laughs> oh man. Yo, he got blew up right there, man. Two plays. So we go on a lengthy drive. They answer back in two. They answer back in just two. Okay, let's see if we could um we keep things going on offense. Let's take a knee here. And it goes into the end zone down for a touchback. threw the ball extremely well on their last drive and they ended up with a touchdown as you can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline though i don't know if they can stop the passing attack but they need to at least be able to slow it down here we go Got it five yards From their own. Got, just got an answer back fellas Second down. Can we get it to him? And we do. Let's go, baby. Scarver with a great catch. Great catch right there. Great throw, man. I didn't know if we'll underthrow him or not. I get nervous if I hesitate on the deep route, man. But that was a great thrown ball. And a big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. Here we go. Got eight yards.
Oh, we see that corner coming off the edge. Let's go. Hitting the tight end, Terrell. So, first and 10, man. Basically, first and goal. Basically, first and goal. Let's see if we can get in. They have a safety down. There it is. Great pitch. Get in there. Lower the shoulder. Touchdown. Gerald Bright, man. Second touchdown of the day. Man, we got a game, bro. We just got to play defense. We got to play D. I like that, though, man. I like that he fell forward. Cause that's all I tried to do right there was fall forward. Lower the shoulder and fall forward. And it definitely worked out. All right, we have the update. New Mexico beating Wyoming. All right. <laughs> it's not really that significant. I know it is our um, conference, but. Utah State lines up for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Brad, this is my kind of game. So both running games, ours and theirs, is um is performing well today. Hopefully, theirs was just a two-play fluke. We're going to blitz, man. Let's see if they're going to run it again. I mean, I wouldn't blame them for running the ball again. They are. Oh, no. Play action. They're just playing smart football, man. Knowing we were going to come up after we got just gashed the first two plays. Uh, they just ran right past the quarterback, man. His stick, he doesn't fumble it, though. And in two plays, Boise State crosses midfield. Get ready for probably the last play of the, of the quarter. They're throwing it. He's running. Bro, go after the quarterback. You're just staring at him, man. All right, so that ends the first. That ends the first. This is going to be a uh, this is going to be a close one, man. I can feel it. Jet sweep. Great tackle. Great tackle for one. Stopped him from getting to the outside, man. Now we're going to get a. Uh, Gonna we'll get a third down. Third down now. They need to get it down to the 33. See if we can lock up well enough. Slip screen. Oh, we're there. There it is. Great tackle again, man. Great tackle. I don't know if they're they might be too far. They're punting the ball, supposedly, man. They might really do it, but let's go um safe. Punt return safe just in case. He's gonna try to cough and corner this one. So they actually gonna punt it. And we'll let this bounce in the end zone. This one will go in. Alright, we got a chance to get some separation here. Even if it's just a field goal, we definitely want something. Yeah, one of the triple option. Hopefully they don't put a receiver over there. They're manned up. Uh, they're in the zone. Still might be good, man. Safeties are coming up, so they might blitz. Oh, wow. They didn't blitz, but uh, nice pickup. Gerald Bright, man. He's having a good day. He's on the Heisman list. I didn't understand why. He's showing me why he's on the list right now. Great play selection, um, balance, man. Eight throws, eight runs. There it is. There it is. Another first down. Our offense is playing great. 
defense um, stepped up when we needed to on that last drive. But if we could keep this up, what you would assume, we probably can't keep this up all game, man. But if we could, that would be great. Safeties are all the way up, man. Let's see if Mariner can get open. He's not going to get open. Just throw it away. Oh, we got rid of that just in time. Just in time. That was almost a sack. That would have been a big loss, too. Let's not flood him. They want to go zone, man. We're going to flood him out of this. Or not. Oh, we are. Great catch, man. I didn't think he was going to get open there. I was waiting. He got open. He got open, man. So, another great throw. Jordan Love looking good, man. Tunnel screen. There it is. Nine yards, man. Scarver's having a good day. Four catches, 79 yards already. Rex, yo, what's going on, man? Welcome back to the stream. All right, so second and one. Can we get this? We're going to run it. Good blitzing. Doesn't matter. Let's go. Jail Bright, man. I'm doing good, man. I'm doing good. Hopefully, you're having a good day. Hopefully, everybody in the stream is also having a good day. Good catch. Bright, man, with the moves. With the moves, man, nine yards. You have to steal curtain of college football. I just seen that comment, man. I wish. See if we catch them. I don't know if we can catch them with a draw on second to one. I don't think we want to run the draw here anyway. Go with a quick pass, possibly. Oh man, we got sacked. Nobody got open. They locked up across the line. And we just did a terrible job blocking right there. All right, so third and eight. Oh, let's, let's see what they come out in. Alignment-wise. Yeah, I don't like this. I feel like a run might be able to get them here on third and eight. And they're pinching it in. Let's get to the outside, baby. Oh, you couldn't hold that block. Mm. I don't know why. I thought that was going to work, man. But it's all right. We're going to settle for this field goal. It's good, man. We need a separation. We got some. We're up 10. I'm cool with that. Wyoming, they win their game against New Mexico. So they're four and two, man. They're trying in the Mountain West. He really got a hold of that kick, and it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. All right, man. So let's um. Stay nickel. I was going to go dime. I feel like they're going to throw it, but the way they ran the ball early, man, it, it got me nervous. You never know. Throwing the ball here. You do a great job. Can we tackle a quarterback? We do. He almost got away there, though. I feel like we need to put a spy on him because he is taking off. He is taking off, and he is um, running really well, too. Right, so let's put a spy. Second down. Check it down to the running back. We get a good tackle. There's going to be third and short. 
They could really come out with anything here. I don't know if I'm confident enough to go cover zero. So <laughs> let's keep one safety back. QB read. Oh, he stepped. Oh, he got the first. I thought he stepped out maybe before he got across that line. I feel like nobody was really playing that but me. So here we go. Here they come. I don't know how he scored that in there. It was a great throw. I'm not even mad at that one, man. But they get the ball first to start the second half. So we do not want them to score realistically. Um, they're going to get another chance to possibly take the lead. Draw play. Big hit, man. No fumble. And they use the timeout. So they're down to one. So we're going to come out on our dime. I, I just wouldn't expect them to uh, to run the ball now with only one timeout. But they could catch us off guard. I mean, we never know. What is our lineman doing, bro? What are they? What are they doing? Somebody's going to come back. Oh, yo, tackle him. Yo, we cannot tackle, bro. That's the field goal range now after that. All the way back in field goal range. So, quarterbacks five for five. He's running. Get him. Okay. We missed, man, but <laughs> let's go, Boise State. I hope not. Oh, if you let this quarterback all right, third down. They're bringing in tight end. Something tells me, though, they're not, not going to run it here. I mean, we don't know, man. It's just they did. Did we stop him? He's short. He is short. Yes, sir, baby. Yes, sir, man. Hold him. Hold him to an extra point, not extra point, a field goal attempt. I don't know if we can ice before halftime. So why not? It doesn't hurt. It does not hurt. They'll line it up for the field goal. And they can make this a one possession game with this kick right here. <laughs> yeah, Rex was a good stop, man. They get the field goal though. Seven point game. They do get the ball first. But uh I mean it was way better than giving up a touchdown at this point. And who knows? Maybe we get something going on this return. Right from the two. He's to the 20. Mm. Down he goes at the 26-yard line. So the Aggies obviously. Not much, man. You see Gerald Bright. He's still been running the ball well. Working, Herbie, but, you know, you can't just rely on one guy. No, we don't get the ball first. They get the ball first at halftime. So um we need to we don't need to get a field goal I and mean, we can go into halftime up seven but perfect world that'd be great i don't know if he's jamming nathan oh he's open and he got it let's go man let's go great great ball placement of that that was close that could have been picked, man, but <laughs> Ooh, what a catch. We're at the 38. So let's see how the defense. So let's see if we go down. quick First throw, maybe. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wide outs. Here they come. Here we go. Let's get out of bounds. We get four yards, we'll kick a field goal, man. Kick a field goal, see if we can make this 10 in the halftime. 
Yeah, man, that was a great catch. We have the wind on our side. Utah State is up by a touchdown. The kick is up. Kick is good. Yes, sir, man. 10 point lead heading to halftime. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites David Pollock and I here in the studio. Yeah, it was a far field goal, man. We have a really good kicker, though. We have a really solid kicker. Um, so, I mean, we just put him in a the, in the spot where he could go and, and make it. And he made it, man. So, I think offensively, we played a great, great half of football. Defense, we gotta, you know, we gotta tweak some things a little bit, but we, we're coming, we're playing better. You know what I mean? We're trying to get our our mojo back, our swag back, all that good stuff, man. But offensively, I think we're playing, we're playing well. See, 196 passing yards in the first half, 51 rushing yards. Had the ball for basically eight and a half minutes. Yeah, we look solid, definitely, definitely, man. Edward, what's going on, bro? Welcome to the stream, man. All right, one half of football left. One half of football left, man. Number one, the number one team to beat the number three team. I couldn't see the teams of which team they were, but I just seen that at the bottom. Which will help us out as long as we get the win. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. All right, guys, we're blitzing. First play here in the second half. Cover zero, and they're throwing the ball. Oh, man. We're just a little out of out of our distance to try to pick that off. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. Great throw. Took a big hit, man, but great throw. Jalen Henderson, man, he is picking us apart right now. Yeah, Rex, no worries, man. Appreciate you for stopping through. Hopefully, um, hopefully we get the dub for you, man. Cole, what's going on, bro? Welcome back to the stream. All right, so four-yard reception. Looks like Boise is trying to um, they're trying to put together a good drive. Also, it's second down, six yards to go. Ball on their own forty-three. Oh, he's running. Can we get to him? Can we get to him? Oh, he fumbled it. We picked it up. Yo, let's go, baby. Finally, we make a play on defense. Finally, man, because this quarterback, he's been running on us, been throwing all on us. That's a big one, man. We need more separation on this drive. Apples, yeah, man. It is a close game, but hopefully we could, um, you know, we could start putting some separation between us. So we're just about ready to return to action. Oh, great move. At the yard line. Seven yards. We've been um, slinging the rock pretty good today, man. Yeah, I did see Jeremy Pruitt got fired today, man. I don't know what uh, Tennessee's going to do from here. I heard Peyton Manning's going to heavily influence the next hire. We'll see what they we'll see what they do. From the 39 yard line, it's first down. Uh, 
did we miss we miss a lot of people man but we're gonna just take what we can get it's end up being four yards so i mean that's not that's not awful awful though he rushes two yards we got to run it now our lineman's is also tired so this may not end very well but um we gonna try to <laughs> try to see what we can do here really don't like this i feel like we motion him over yeah spread him out a little bit get the extra block or two there it is first down cover the ball up move the chains baby this looks more fun than Madden 21. I've been having more fun with this than Madden, man. But I, I also put NCAA down for a while, so I get some people that, like, burnt out from playing the same game. I haven't played NCAA in a while, man. And since I came back to it, like, two weeks ago, um, I've been having a great time. Ooh, let's go. I thought that uh, the defender was going to come up with a big hit. No, I've, I haven't seen All American. My brother, my little brother, watches it though. He told me I need to I need to watch it. Or how many corners they need they need on that side? Clearly, they're blitzing somebody, right? There it is. First down, man. All right, so another solid drive. Let's see if we can cap it off with the touchdowns. Been a while since we got in the end zone. Jordan Love, though, 17 for 18. Stats looking good. Hopefully, um, we don't turn the ball over now that I said that. Uh, really? No oh, did I miss? I could have threw the A. I feel like I keep missing guys, man. Season 3 came out. I'm going I'm to hop into it, man. Like I said, I, I've missed it. I missed a lot of it, so. Here's the eighth play of the series. All right, fellas. Second and seven, Jordan Love is exhausted. I don't want to use a timeout here if I don't have to, but look at Gerald Bright. Touchdown, he's in there. His third touchdown of the day. What a run, great blocks, man. Great blocks right there. We're pulling away. We're starting to pull. Look at those blocks, yo. They were not playing. <laughs> They was tired. They was not playing at all. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. Uh, do I play on PS3? No, I'm on um, Xbox 360. Good old, uh, good old 360 here, man. Where do I think Deshaun Watson will play? He's serious with the organization. I don't know, man. That there's so many teams that could use it. I know Miami. They talk about Miami a lot. Um, I think San Fran will be a great fit. Uh, Oakland, I'm not Oakland, Las Vegas now. I'm used to saying that for the Raiders, man. <laughs> There's a lot of places he could potentially go. Hit you when 2K gets to run the NFL this year. I don't know what type of game is going to be. Uh, so I'm holding some reservations. I don't know what it, what it is, man, but I'm excited for it. Any new football game. Please don't talk about Deshaun. You're from Houston, man. Well, I apologize, man. I know there was supposed to be some type of protest or something right in behalf of Deshaun Watson today that he canceled. There's no way, man. There's no way. I should have controlled that. That's what happens when you trust the computer to do your work for you, man. He just runs past the ball and never comes back. Yeah, we're ranked seventh in the country right now. Ah, uh, we got beat. That was all me. That was all me. I bid on that play action. I completely bid on that play action. We're ranked seventh. We're trying to hold on to that ranking. We also got two, two three-star commits at Utah State, so I'm cool with that, man. This is their second two-play drive touchdown of the uh, game. 
Which we got to do better limiting the big plays, man. A lot better with that. He just drills this one. He's to the 10. He's taken down at the 17. Not a good return. It's all good, though, man. If we can go down, put together another good drive. We're playing great offensively. Oh, do we throw the... We threw the pick, man. We threw the pick. First turnover of the day. I thought he was going to keep going straight. He just got stuck behind him. He just got stuck behind him, man. All right, here we go, fellas. We got ourselves a game. From the 17 yard line, first down. There we go. Great tackle, man. Great tackle. Defense needs to step up. If we can hold him to a field goal here. That'll be a win. How many games you got? Uh, we're six and zero, oh, so we're halfway through the season, man. Now they're gonna run the football. Great counter. All right, so we need a goal line stand now. They're inside the five. Inside the five. First and goal from the four, looking for Pater. All right, first and goal. QB's going to keep it. Uh, we try to hit stick him, man. He gets in the end zone anyway. And Boise's right back in this game, man. They are right back in it. Uh, Derek says, have I thought about doing a team builder dynasty? I did do one, man. It's kind of when I got burnt out of NCAA. Um, but who knows, man? I might be back with another dynasty um, now that college football revamped and all this stuff's back out. And I've been having more fun with the game since, since I put it down. But I needed that break. I needed that break from NCAA. But having a lot of fun now. Jacob, what's going on, bro? Welcome back, man. Came back just in time as um, Boise State just came back. <laughs> There's really nothing there. And they push him out around the 21 yard line. The Broncos have really Look at that second half, man. They have not been Only 53 yards for us. Great to see the attitude and we got to get this thing going again. Yeah, man. Falcons getting Arthur Smith, man. That's a great pickup. Arthur Smith's been great for the Titans. Um, so I hope he does his thing in Atlanta. We might have a game come forth. Uh, yeah, we got a game now, man. So, <laughs> so yes. Now, we need to put something here on this drive. Put something together, man. See if Manor can get open. He's going to get open. He's open. Let's go. Let's go. Cross the 40. You feel bad for Pat Mahomes? You talking about because of the concussion? Ooh. That was close. That was close, man. That could have been a pick. That could have been a pick. William, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream, bro. For those of y'all that are also in the stream, man, leave us a like. It'll help me out a lot, man. I definitely appreciate it. Here it is. Good blocking. Bright's been having a great day. 14 for 93 touchdowns. He's tired on this possession uh, on this play though, but he's been having a good day. Hey man, a couple plays left. I'm cool with that miss, though, man. At least he missed when nobody was there to pick it off. It's a big third down. Third and four. Four 
yards away here on third down. Guaranteed the Bills win to Chad Henney plays. <laughs> it's a huge possibility, man. We'll see. Great throw, great catch. Jordan Nathan, man, been pretty quiet. Had that one good catch earlier, but that's another big one right there. It's another big one. So we're right here. We might, as well, might as well let the quarter end, man. Y'all do me a favor, man. Put the fours up in the chat as we head into the fourth quarter. It's another close one. Another close one. Another close finish. You see, you see if we start pulling away a little bit. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Utah State is up by three. He's on the run. Get rid of it. Get whatever we could get. Way to fall four, man. Fours. I love it. I love it, man. Seeing it in the chat. Um, when's the next UD video is coming out? Hopefully, hopefully tomorrow, man. The video is done. I was trying to get it out tonight. And for whatever reason, it kept crashing every time I tried to export the video and render it. So, uh, I'm gonna try after the stream to see if I could get it, um, up and, and uploaded tonight and schedule it for tomorrow. All right. So the blitz is coming. See if we can still get it in there. The blitz was coming, man. We're trying to run past the blitz. Almost worked. It almost worked right there. Now I just want to go with a stick. See if they leave us one-on-one -on, -one on the left side. And it looks like they might. I see that guy out there. No, he got jammed up. He got all the way jammed up, man. And we, we need to get this in the end zone. We really don't want a field goal here. So this is a big third. Third down, man. Ah, man, it's nerve-wracking, man. Here we go. It's third and goal. He's in there. Touchdown, man. Jordan Nathan. Great catch. That's going to give us a little bit of a cushion, man. We definitely wanted that right there. We needed that. Uh, how many years you staying at Utah State? I don't know, man. I don't know. I might be here for a while. I might be here for a while. I don't plan on being one and done or really two and done. So, obviously, I mean, the online is online dynasty with a couple of my friends. So, if the perfect job opens up or maybe Kentucky opens up, but other than that, man, you might be here for a cool minute. All right, Cole, I appreciate you for coming through, man. Be good. And, yeah, see you next stream. Hopefully, though, guys, we could uh, finish this game out. No quick touchdowns. Hopefully, preferably no touchdowns at all, but no quick ones, man. Uh, hopefully, I could bring them a championship. Or just bring the championship. Hopefully, we can, man. That's the goal. We're looking good this year, man. We beat Alabama this year. But we've been having a lot of close games lately, so... Uh, we need a lot of stuff to go our way. Jerome says he took a late hit. He did, man. Crazy late hit. All right, so solid run, man. They've been running the ball well. I mean, for real, they've been throwing. They've been playing pretty good. So we'll see. We'll see if we can get a stop. Another run, cut back, tackle him. He gets the first down, man. Told you, he's just, he's just legitly run eight for one oh seven. Like he is running hard today. And 
I'll take that. Uh, how many in the group? We got six, man. Six in this online dynasty of um good friends of mine, man. So. Oh, yo, he got jacked up there, man. He is not fumbling, not dropping it, none of that stuff. Crazy, man. Uh, he's going to take off running. We don't have a quarterback spy. He took a big hit there, too, man. He fumbled once today. He fumbled once today. There's a fumble there. He's going right. And he's immediately tackled. Man, he's putting this ball perfectly right so now, man. What did I miss? Ah, this has been a good back and forth game. Based on connection between the quarterback and his receiver. Like there we go. Ball start, baby. Move them back. In a game like this, we're gonna take all of every yard we can get. Alabama just beat UK sixty-two to ten. So if that job opens up and they offer it to me, I'm probably heading to Lexington, man. But so we'll have first and fifteen after the penalty. And we're bringing some pressure here. Zips it to the tight end. That uh, wasn't enough, man. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least. Jacob says, what are they ranked? You talking about uh, Alabama? Alabama's ranked. Uh, oh, Boise. You talking about Boise State. They're not ranked at all. They are unranked, man. This is the eighth play of this drive. We out here hitting. We hitting, but they ain't fumbling, so. Less than three minutes in the game. Second down. <laughs> Slip screen. Ah, uh, great block. And we can't tackle, man. We can hit, we can't tackle. So Boise, man, is going to make this a three-point game. So it's the running back who shows off his hands on the touchdown. It's such a bonus to have a back who can contribute to the passing game. Ah, oh, man. Is this another close one? Fellas, this is another close one, man. I don't think we've had a laid-back blowout yet <laughs> everything has to be dramatic right there we go bright do something here here we go there we go great move go bright oh what a tackle mm. man i thought he had a chance to take that to the crib all right so 219. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still a couple of first downs will win it for us. Oh, we're keeping that. Great blocking. Great blocking. Sliding down, man. And they got to use their first timeout. I don't know why it shows us calling a timeout. We're not calling a timeout right now. There it is, man. I feel good after that one. I feel good. Two more first downs and it's over, right? Maybe one more, depending on it. They're stacking the box, though. Yeah, he's going to run with them good. Here we go. Great blocking. Did we get it? Ah, inches short, which helps us out, though. Makes them use another timeout. I mean, this is a game. We get this in there, man. This is a game. All right, fellas. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Let's go. Yes, sir, baby. I feel like we can nail it out the rest of the way. Let's see what um as coach says. They'll tell us. I guess not. Apparently, we can't nail it out the rest of the way. So let's just <laughs> let's just run the ball real quick. Get the clock going. Maybe one more wins it. Well, for sure, one more first down. I know that will win it. Here we go, Jordan Love. And it carries the ball for a nice game. That's good for a game of four yards. That brings up second and 
Man. Just get out of here with the win. That's all we're trying to do right now. From the 29 yard line, second down. Everybody's in the box, man. Ooh. You see how quick they came through? We're just lucky we get back to the line of scrimmage right there. Am I ever going to play college football revamped? Uh, yeah, I have a lot of those videos on my channel, man. So just go through my go through my channel. You'll see some um, CFB revamped on there. This is an online dynasty, so I have to play the regular version, man. You can't play on 360. The re you can't play revamped on a regular Xbox. There it is. Let's go. And that's game, baby. That is game. We can come out, take two knees, and get out of here, man. And get out of here, man. What a close win. What a close, close win. If I kick a field goal here, hold on. Wait a second, man. Our kicker wanted us to kick a 40-yarder. Where are we at? Oh, yeah. We're going to... I'm about to be petty and kick a field goal, man. It's for the recruit. It's for the kicker that's here, man. He wants us to kick a 40-yarder. We're going to kick a 40-yarder. We kicked a field goal earlier. I don't remember if it was from 40 or not. So let's just play safe and kick this one from 41 right here. Oh, yeah, we made a 51, a 50-yarder earlier. So this is me being excessive, man. But here we go. We get the field goal. It's good. 37-31 win. Man, these guys got us out here working to win these games, man. Staff just dancing on the sideline. Their star player came through for him, and they couldn't be happy. Well, the staff has to feel good. Look at Bright, man. He's showing why he's on the Heisman list. He's probably not going to win it, like I said, but he's showing why he is on the list. 19 for 116, three rushing touchdowns. Not a bad day at the office, man. All right, let's take a look here at these stats. Take a look at these stats. So we got to upgrade after that game, which is great. Scoring summary, of course. Uh, they got us in the third quarter, man. It was a close game, really close game. Look at the team stats. They We got 416 yards. They had 366. Uh, we both turned the ball over one time. So the turnover really wasn't the story of this game, man. Jordan Love, 22 of 25, 281 touchdown. And then that bonehead interception that we threw for whatever reason, man. Uh, running the ball, we already seen Gerald Bright, 19 for uh, 116. Jordan Love, 8 for 16. Um, he has two sacks, though. Carson Terrell, the tight end, 6 for 45. Um, Savon Scarver, 5 for 85. Jordan Nathan, 4 for 78. So our receivers did their thing today. I'm definitely proud of these guys, man. Definitely proud of these guys. On the defensive side, tackles led by uh, Troy Lefegge Jr. I don't know if I said his name right, man. Um, David Woodward had five tackles as well. So, I mean, we played we played a good game all around, man. Jacob says, GG, appreciate it, man. Definitely, um, we're trying to stay undefeated, trying to keep things going. Um, had to sell my 360 a while back, trying to find me one right now. Hey, man, it's, it's not bad. I've been enjoying this game. The hard part, hopefully you still have NCAA because that is crazy expensive. I'm trying to find a copy of that. Uh, what is your record? We are now 7-0 after that win. So 7-0 starting off the second half of our season on the right, on the right note. Hopefully we get some more commits, man. We, we're getting to that point where people need to start, you know, signing and committing. And hopefully they start doing that. Um, really soon, man. So we have an upgrade. Go to upgrade. Um, what's your overall opinion of the revamped version? It's not a different game. It's just different dressing on the game. Um, I'm a fan of it, though. It just changes the way things look. Um, some of the textures, especially in the SEC stadiums, I know they're going to update Big Ten uh, stadiums are pretty cool. It just gives you a different vibe, man. But the game itself, obviously, it's the same game. So, um... I enjoy it. 
like I said, there'll be some more content on the channel this week from um, College Football Revamped. The PS3 version of Revamped is very easy to install. I have no experience with three, uh, the PS3 version, but um, yeah, man, I, from what I've heard, I mean, they have step-by-step -step instructions, so it's not that hard to install it, man. It's a pretty cool, pretty cool um, thing that, they, that they're able to really buy that into the game, man. It brought new life into this old game. So speaking of anything, man, you see the coaches poll. We are seven media poll. We are also seven, so we're seven in both polls. Yeah, I'm six and no regional TV, one and no national TV. I think that was the Alabama game, I'm assuming. Um, you see our leaders right there. Eight interceptions from Jordan Love. I do not like that at all. I think four was from the last game. So uh, hopefully we could we could approve upon that. And you see the the schedule the rest of the way. Nobody crazy tough, right? So New Mexico, then we have Hawaii. So it looks like New Mexico, then a bye week, then Hawaii, UNLV, Colorado, the bye week, Colorado State, then Wyoming. So I feel like we could run the table. I feel like you could run the table, man. Um, and maybe we need LSU to maybe lose one. Oklahoma, LSU could potentially lose if they go to the SEC or no, they're going to have to play um, Bama, man. Hopefully they lose to, unless they already play Alabama. No, they're going to have to play Florida. Then they're going to have to play Bama and even A&M. So LSU could definitely lose, man. Um, A&M, they played number three, Texas. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Oh, no, no. They just beat number three, Texas. I just seen that score at the bottom of my thing. So that's not going <laughs> to, they don't have to worry about that one, man. Let's go to the um, coaches poll. So yeah, Texas is out. Michigan, who they play the rest of the way. They play Penn State, Indiana, Michigan State, Nebraska, um, Iowa, and then Ohio State, Northwest. I'm going to think of NU for a second, man. So maybe they could lose the Iowa or the Ohio State game. Ohio State has Iowa this week, then Penn State, Purdue, Illinois, Indiana, Michigan. Hopefully they could lose one of these games. So if we get some of these guys to start falling off, maybe we could start kind of elevating our way into possibly playing in this national championship game. Virginia Tech doesn't have a tough schedule either the rest of the way. They got Pitt, Duke, Boston College, Miami, Maryland, and Virginia. So uh, we don't have a tough schedule. We need guys to start dropping and start losing games. Uh, we need Alabama to make our, our win on them look better. We need them to start winning games. So we'll see, man. We'll see what happens. But um, we're going to go ahead and get out of here, man. Hopefully, we get another stream up tomorrow or Wednesday. Uh, one of those two days, man. Uh, I think we only got one guy left. No. Everybody's done. So as soon as they advance it, man, we're good to go. So hopefully, um, tomorrow, I might be back with another stream, man. Um, I have University of Delaware Dynasty Mode NCAA 06 video dropping tomorrow. Subscribe if you're not subscribed to the channel. We have college football revamped dropping on the channel this week, man. So definitely stay tuned to that. Also, before we get out of here, please leave the stream a like, man. It helps me out a lot. But that's all I got, man. Hope you guys did enjoy it. It's your boy D. Lloyd. I'm going to see y'all next time, man. Peace.